Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to Hitman 2. So last time we killed a lady in a very satisfying manner. Well, it's not that the kill itself was that interesting, all I did was basically push her into a hole. However, at the time, I was wearing a flamingo mascot uniform, so that made it pretty cool. Anyway, so now we're after Robert Knox, and last time we just poisoned him and kicked him into the river. And that was pretty funny, because being Florida Man was every bit as entertaining as I'd hoped. However, we found something interesting, a journal from his chief android officer or something. I don't remember what the actual journal was about, and I don't care, because he has a chief android officer. And now I want to find out more about this slightly mysterious company. Okay, there's people talking on the TV. Blah, 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 drug war escalation. Actually, we'll have something to do with that. This is my first gig. So let's kind of take a look around. Before, Employees sure only. Loud. Shaw. I heard something about a secret demo upstairs in the expo Ooh. building, but it's off limits apparently. Yeah, Ooh. Knox owns the whole thing. He straight up just bought it before the race. Downstairs is okay. Upstairs, mm, not so much. Okay. Any well, let's go upstairs. I heard he's demoing the next big thing coming out of Kronstadt, oh, wait. but only to big money people. Really? No to get in, well, that's a well, there's a great what chance of me nice getting in, but that's because I'm good at all kinds of things. I don't need a hammer. Um, where am I? So this is an aquarium. So if I wanted to go upstairs... Looks like there's just that one staircase over there where we were, to the left. Let's check out the aquarium, though. I love aquariums. I mean... Okay, to a large degree, once you've seen an aquarium, you've seen all the aquariums, but that doesn't mean they're not cool. Regular security, pshaw. I scoff at your regular security. I'm never sure where I've been. Wait, hold on a second. Sharks are people too. Nah, nah, nah. If they were people, they'd be called people. Ooh, hello. Now, is this where we started? Yes. Okay, good. So now I know where I am again. Okay. So there's that staircase over here. Did I finish looking around the main floor, though? Yeah, private property, blah, blah, blah. I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything interesting, you know? Still no dedicated map button. Just saying. Mmm. There's this whole second half over here. That person knows me, though, so if I'm going to go through there, i got to be a little more careful. From the CIA. Probably I can just go this way. Through this obvious, you know, area right here. Ooh, there's... Right next to this guy that'll recognize me. How should I get rid of him? Is there another way through, just like over here? I mean, I got key cards for days. Oh, hello. Androids. Ugh, hold on, we'll come back to you. Hi. G, activate exhibition stand. Oh. Shut up, shut up, shut up. I must it said something, like, interesting about how it doesn't recognize me, but then the guy was still talking over the top of it. Our brand new super fuel, eh? What's a super fuel? Oh, mystery story. Right, hold on. Hmm, I wonder if he's kung fu fighting. Robert Interesting. Knox has a race car on display in the expo building. The show staff is under strict instructions to summon him at any sign of malfunction. Apparently, Knox trusts no one to fix his car but him. Hmm. Perhaps it's time to poke around under the hood, 47. They do say one should never mess with another man's wheels. Interesting, but not as dramatic as I'm hoping for. Okay, super fuel. I wonder how I would have gotten a hold of this. Very interesting, don't you think? Very interesting. Okay, what's this thing? What is this? Alright, companionship, blah blah blah. 
millions of units the king okay. was an overnight success. Well has been the friend to I don't know what it is. Is it just a rolling ball that then talks to you? What is this? Excuse me. I'm just here to walk in front. These are interesting, sorry. The well being of the world is one of the most important things to Uh blah blah blah. Okay. Not as interesting as it could be. Yeah, there's that scary surgical system. Um, is that the same one that we used in that one Japanese place to uh, sabotage? Let's see, the guy was getting a heart transplant and ended up squishing it and it was hilarious. Yeah, so we could totally sabotage the engine, but eh, again, eh. That'd be kind of cool, but... Eh. Let's go upstairs and let's see what's going on up there. Hello, Bactoris. Um... Oh, neat. Okay. Employees only, blah, blah, blah. Anything interesting back here? Not as such. I don't need screwdrivers. Okay, we're by, back here in the aquarium. Okay, so let's go head up that staircase then. Let's look at the fish. Hi, fish. It's like Subnautica, but not as cool. Here we go. Employee access only. Well, good news. The fish is an everyman. All right. Oh, hi, robots. I'm hearing rumors on the corporate grapevine. Apparently, Knox wants to do a large-scale field test of the palace. In good day to you, sir. Wait, hold on. That sounds like mm, one hang on, 47. Robert Knox's calendar shows a meeting with the Ted Mendez, a defense funding consultant with the U.S. military. It must be related to that robot. Oh. Maybe you can find Mendez somewhere. Hi, what's up? Ted Mendez, a defense funding consultant with the U.S. military, is scheduled for a private demonstration of a new Kronstadt robotics project. Sounds like a way to get up close and personal with Robert Knox, 47. See, now that sounds interesting. What are these? Um, pictures, 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 yeah. What does this do? Scan picture for the Android targeting system. I see where that could possibly go. If we could get a picture, I'll bet we could do something hilarious with it. Okay, but we would need to get someone's uniform. Hold on. Sure does. Okay. Well, apparently we're wondering about the rise of the machines, but I'm sure it's fine. Everything's fine. Wouldn't it be great if I could just turn all these things crazy? I think that would be hilarious. So we can go find that guy. Um, there's someone over here that'll recognize us. Was this an office door over here? Well, Conference room. <gasps> here we go. Like that Kai project they launched Hold on, let's listen. I enjoy the prospect of tacos a lot better than what you're suggesting. Mm, tacos. Shoving something that advanced in Collecting pictures of celebrity entrepreneurs now 47? Hmm. Asking us what are you thinking? I want to hear them. Tell me about it. I know the boss really likes the whole let's change the face of war motto of the campaign, but yeah. it's just scaring the heck out of me. Yeah, we do that. Don't worry. He's not long for this world. So my assumption here is that that android will attack whatever you scanned a photo of. So if I could get a hold of one of the um, lab uniforms, and I could head in and, uh, you know, scan him instead of one of the targeting dummies, then it might shoot at him instead. Let's take a screwdriver just in case I need an... Oh, okay, I already have one. I was just going to say, in case I need another tool, but that's fine. Let's keep an eye out for people. Pose myself as Ted Mendez. Yeah, 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 yeah. We could do that. Or I could keep looking around. Because looking around is fun. Apples? Eh, I'm okay. Wow, this suit is like all-purpose access. This is great. More rat poison. I don't need that, but we'll take it anyway. I guess it's not more rat poison. It's just some rat poison. Hmm. Uh-oh. So there's a third floor up there, so I should find the staircase and go upstairs, because I'm curious. Um, let's be careful of these guys.
proceeds to not be careful. Okay. Yep. Good, good, good. Okay. Interesting. Office. Yes. Um, scissors. I don't need any more scissors. But thank you. A place to dump bodies. Thank you. I'm fine. Nice view of the racetrack, but the race is over. Okay. Sorry, I I just really like getting to see everything. Oh, there's him. Hi. Yes, our project. Security. Of course. Pick up an android arm. Why would I want an arm? Can I use them to hit other people with? Because that would be pretty funny. Hmm. So I could get one of these guys in here and take their uniform. Is that too rude? No, I'm just kidding. Nothing's too rude. Uh, okay, let's use the scissors as a distraction. Everyone knows that scientists can't resist a good pair of scissors. Perfect. Show yourself, you coward. Hey, buddy. What's up? Not you any longer. Oh, oh, that was funnier than I expected it to be. Well, okay. Maybe that's a little strong. Funny's a bit of an exaggeration. Okay, so let's not forget where it is I left this uniform. Whoa, hold on. Wrong button. Sorry about that. Ah! My buttons. Okay, there we go. So I love the idea of screwing this thing up by feeding it the wrong photograph. But I wonder if that's really the first step I should be taking. Come on, hurry up, guys. And I have to find my way up to the third floor. You know what? Let's let's do that first. Third floor first. I just want to see what's up there. I just can't I just can't wait any longer. Hello, how's everything going here? Great, fine, excellent. The server room, you say? Hello. Notebooks on robotics. Um, goes into some detail on Palace, but keeps digressing into another project he's, he's nicknamed Dolores. Trying to, trying to create a companion, huh? Alright. Is this a key card I already have? No, it's not. Good, good, good. Arms. Yeah. Oh, hello. There's probably a staircase, but this is more fun. There we go. And how do I get off? Come on. X hang. There we go. X to scale. Okay. I bet these controls make a lot more sense if um, you're using a controller. Which I am not. Because I'm not clever enough to use a dual stick controller. Knox manages to Whoa. get this out to the public. We'll know everything about everyone. Moods, location, drug influences, who they really? with, and when. Anything at the touch of a button. So that's why he bought Sangwin. A range of smart clothes for the ultra wealthy. Bullet ah. Full range communication with cloud based servers. Ah, the clouds. Yeah. Everyone loves the clouds. Okay. So I want to get out there and knock one of those guys out, but it's actually going to be fairly difficult getting over there. Let's see here. We've got a TV at his distraction. Why will this guy recognize me? Hmm. It'd be very difficult to get these people knocked out. We'll have to be careful. <laughs> I love saying things like that. Yes, this issue his left eye. You know, the one that got burned in the accident way back. Apparently it dries out in low humidity. Storage. Yes, yes. Bathroom. Yes, yes. A different sir. Oh, hello. Shotgun. Okay. We don't need a shotgun, but it's good to know there's one there. And you're just kind of hanging out. Okay. Okay, interesting. Okay. So, what else is there? Yeah. 
Yeah, it would have been hard getting up that staircase the normal way. Luckily, very little of what we do is normal. Whoa. Have I been over to this other side yet? I think that was where I just looked at and decided I couldn't sneak past, which means I need to sneak past it. See, that guy's not paying a lot of attention. Whoa. Nice. Thank you for protecting our freedom, sir. Hey, no problem, man. If there's one thing I do, it's protect all kinds of freedoms. Interesting. Okay. Nice gym. We could exercise, but we're not going to. Let's keep an eye on these supervisors, because there's quite a few of them up here. For example. Luckily, there's these convenient plants to duck behind. Get out of here. Now, is this some place we just were? I think it is. Yeah, yeah, this is just the other side. Okay, so let's go find this guy, and let's disguise ourselves as him. Hold on. Hello. Robert's office. I almost missed this. So I could... Set to dry mode? Okay. That's a little weird. Oh, hello. Electronic access dongle, you say? Used to access a piece of electronic equipment. Looks like a satellite dish or something similar. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Whoa! These guys have anything good out here? No. They're just guys. Okay, let's go find this guy and uh, impersonate him. I think I'm gonna have to go back down this way because the staircase had some people that will know me. Tragically. That's okay, because climbing down these is pretty fun too. X to climb. Slide down. Okay, very good. Give me a rundown of your cognitive process at this minute. How are you feeling? My emotional default for the day has been set to excited, sir. Hmm. Miss Berman seemed to think that was an appropriate setting. Okay. Would you like me to adjust it? Well, that's fine. Palace. This thing is hilarious. Oh, uh, this bust of palace upon his chamber door. Anyway, never mind. My assumption, by the way, is that's a reference to Pallas Athena. So, that just saying. That is Ted Mendez, one of the country's most influential military-grade money men. This must be connected to Kronstadt. Mm-hmm. This is pretty. Hey, buddy. Phil, What's up? It's Ted here. Just returning your call before heading over to the Expo building to meet Knox for the new combat android presentation. No, not yet. I'm letting him stew a little. Guy's a genius, and you know what they're like. Desperately lacking any discipline or respect for other people. Last time I tried to have a meeting with him, he had me sitting in a room for four hours before canceling. What a jerk. I'll head up when I feel like it. All right, I'll call you after the presentation. Speak then. Hmm. And what are you going to do exactly? Let's just casually follow you. Guy's got a snazzy beret. I wouldn't mind trying that on. Just gonna stand out here and smoke a cigar, huh? 
Alright. Well, there's a perfect place back here to throw a body. Um... Are you attracted to the average screwdriver, my friend? Actually, this isn't going to make nearly enough noise. Oh, maybe it will. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't see me. Quiet. Yoink. And into the box with you. No, don't turn it on. Jeez, I don't want to shred it. Well, I kind of do, but not really. I don't need the screwdriver. I'm going to leave it here. Okay, so if I understand this correctly, first let's make sure I can change quick, safely, um, is I can go attend this meeting and sabotage Palace. I love that plan. I absolutely love it. So I hope that's what it is, because that would be hilarious. The military man. Do I look good in a beret? Oh yeah. Very nice. Everything looks good at the barcode, it turns out. Alright, so we can head up to the executive floor, and I've already got a photo of him. So if I can feed that into Palace's targeting system, well, hilarity may ensue. Mr. Mendez, good to see you, sir. Attend the demonstration. Right this way, sir. Ah. Hi there. Hello. But can I screw around with it first? Yes, yeah, right this way. Thank you. Hello, I do know yeah, the way. Hi, Finn. Yeah, it's trivial. Bye. How you doing? Hey, great. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do this. This will be hilarious. Photo of Robert Knox. Bleep. Ah, Ted. Good to finally see you. Hi. This what's up? was rough. Not never mind. Let me show you everything. Please do. I'm going to say something provocative now, Ted. Say it. War is going out of fashion. It's dirty. It's just plain bad PR. Isn't Nobody it just? wants to exchange their children and loved ones for flags and medals anymore. The glory is gone, Ted. But... Luckily, Kronstadt has a solution for that. Imagine this. Android infiltrators operating in the field, Ooh. disguised and fully embedded, ready to strike at a moment's notice. Disguised. Indestructible robotic operators who can infiltrate the deepest sanctuary of any adversary, striking an unseen fatal blow. Huh. A surgical who could ever do that? For a blood world. Imagine an army of them. Fully equipped android medics seeking out Sorry. wounded servicemen and injured civilians, bringing them to safety, or patching them up then and there. Uh -huh. Android pilots That's exactly what would happen. payloads deep inside enemy territory. Mm, yes. Uncanny precision and minimal collateral damage. All right, Mendez, it's very straightforward. Let me show you. Okay. I just pick any of the pictures on the desk, then I use the scanner to upload the biometric data. Done. Long time no see. Palace will do the rest. There we go. Shouldn't his arm be attached? Obviously, the final system won't rely on you manually feeding it biometric data. This is still a prototype. This hmm. is a pivotal moment in modern conflict solution, Ted. Palace is entirely foolproof. All you need is the hell. Robert Knox. Ah, oh, cripe. <laughs> targets down. Uh, Head for an exit. That was funny. I don't know if he would have kept talking or not, but it's okay. It was totally worth it. He was just going to keep babbling. What's with all these arms, anyway? Can I use them as, like, a bludgeon? That's really funny. Examine. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm stuck. Whoops. Oh, it's because I was carrying the arm. Maybe? I may have to fish someone if I'm not careful. Hey, you. You hearing impaired? Oh, shit. Go away. 
away. Be gone. I should have been carrying that arm around. I'm going to go dig through his stuff before we leave. Because I, I need to find, like, a good car or something. I can't just leave on the boat again. And I'm obviously not just going to, like, walk out. How lame would that be? Now, where are they taking his body? Um... I saw them hauling him, but I didn't see where they went. That's the poor guy I knocked out. Oh, but I need a car. Sir, you need clearance to pass through. Oh. So I can't go up upstairs again. Well, I would have seen a car key if he had it. Well, shoot. I was really hoping to leave in a cool car of some kind, you know. Um. What if I could steal a race car? Wouldn't that be funny? That'd be pretty funny. I'll bet I can't. But you know what? Let's see if I can check. This test has been replaced by a live fire exercise for military androids. Never mind. Wrong game. Is this the car? Oops. Sorry. Jeez. Fine. Rude. All right. Yeah, why don't you come search over here? Come search over here real quick. There's so many android arms. Okay, so whose clothes do I need to sit in the car? Because I really want to go sit in that car for a minute. So how about one of these guys? I don't know if these will make enough noise. Um, let's find out. Yes, but he's going to be too far away, unfortunately. Maybe not. Steady. Hi. Ooh, that may have been too close. There we go. Good, good. As an engineer, that's actually perfect. Is anyone going to walk past me? Will I quick make this change? Doesn't look like it. Okay, good, good. And it's now good for me to walk out here? Okay. I just want to steal it, you know. How are you, sir? I mean, I look cool, but... Nah. All right. All right. Hello there. Hello. So there is an exit listed up on the third floor. That sounds interesting, doesn't it? Let's go find um our clothes that let me go up there without getting shot, because apparently the general's not allowed up there. Ooh. Where did I leave that body? There we go. Let's make sure everything's cool. And... Oh wait, it wasn't a researcher. Well, actually, a researcher might be able to go up there. I don't think so, but let's go find out. Uh, what's up, Doc? Not much. Okay, good. So it's safe to go up here. So what is this? 46 meters. All looks good. Is that like a helicopter or something? Because that would be awesome. Oh yeah, sure is. Unlock the door. Do I have a key for it? I sure don't. Hold on one second. Looks clear. Oh, I don't have a lockpick with me. That's right. Because I went with the explosive. Oh no, that I didn't use. Okay, hold on. Don't worry. Okay, so I can just leave, but obviously that's not what we're going to do first. Let's see here. I almost forgot, guys. The Pale Duck. 
What should we have explode while we walk away from it? Um... <gasps> You're right. That's an excellent idea. Let's go do that. Oh, yeah. Good plan. Yup. Okay, so we need to get the security guy distracted a little. What's up? How's it going? I may have to knock several people out here in order to get the effect I'm looking for. Yeah. Actually, maybe not. Here, let's try this. Did that get the guard's attention? Yes, perfect. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Sorry. What is this, a litter box? Ready? Steady? Ah, crap. I didn't want to kill anybody. Walk away. Walk away. Is there any way for me to, like, get everyone else away? What if... Do I have anything non-lethal? Well, they're not standing close to it. Let's see what happens. Nah, eh, that was alright. I guess I was expecting something a little, I don't know, louder. What if we blow this one up too? What if we just blow up all of his cars? Okay, now this. Hold on, hold on. Now, supposedly, one of you guys said that, like, I can do something else with this, so it's not so obvious, so people don't pick it up. But I don't see any options. Maybe it's because I can't get close to this one. Let's go find another car outside. Oh, you're right. That's an even better idea. What an excellent plan. Good thinking. We'll go do that. There we go. I need this guy to walk away. Ready? Steady? I don't know. Oh, I was hoping that would blow up a little more. Well, the important part is we tried. Alright. Back on upstairs with this. No, what else do I have? I feel like I always leave with a whole bunch of stuff. Well, there's really nothing. Well, here, there's one thing we can do. That's kind of fun that I never actually do. One moment. So I can't use my gun because it's silenced. What if I just like fire wildly into the air? And then jump on the helicopter. Yeah, that was fun. Nice. Well, I hope that that was as much fun to watch as it was to play. Because that was really, really entertaining. Oh, man. Alright, here's a bunch of Chivos and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. My numbers go up a little more. Oh, yeah, look at my number. It's getting bigger all the time. It's up to 34 now. Wow, this is not too shabby. I'm going to assume, by the way, that this number only goes up to 37. So I'm the best that there ever was. Nice. So we've got another agency pickup. Eh. Hidden stash, hidden stash. Ooh. Neat. And a different pistol. Okay. 
and more explosives. Too small to notice. Ooh. Neat. All right. Well, that was a lot of fun. Um, I think that that was an excellent way to spend this evening, is to go around and kill people in a slightly different way. So it looks like next time, actually, this makes sense, we'll go do the three-headed serpent again, and we'll find some more interesting stuff to do. Last time, we ended up just kind of shooting that one lady in her doorway because she got stuck. That wasn't very dramatic, so we'll find something more exciting. So, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you then.